an engine is like the brain or the heart of the ship, so no engine, no reliable seal, ship, it cannot uh, make commerce, but also it can be dangerous. Invented more than a century ago, the diesel engine soon developed into what is now the principal power source of all modern shipping. Today's marine engines are reliable, sophisticated and complex machines, returning higher power output, cleaner exhaust emissions and improved fuel economy. However, this level of performance can only be sustained by operating a rigorous maintenance program and regular engine inspections. These inspections can uh, give you the visual confirmation that there is no wear, or, or there is wear for that matter. This is like extensive cylinder liner scuffing phenomena, or sometimes uh, piston crown cracking, which can be either by not good monitoring or bad lubrication or inappropriate lubrication. And it's a, a very good health check of your engine to ensure that all the results you received match up with what's actually happening in the engine. These inspections may be planned on the basis of running hours, engine maker's recommendations or company policy. Inspections of two-stroke crosshead engines often start at the scavenge space area, as this offers an effective close-up visual assessment of a piston and cylinder. On entering the scavenge space, it's possible to see whether there is a build-up of sludge or excessive oil deposits. The engine can then be turned so that the piston is lowered and made visible through the scavenge ports. It's possible then to inspect the piston skirt for scuffing or abrasion while checking the piston rings for damage or carbon buildup. The piston can then be further lowered so that the crown can be inspected for evidence of poor fuel burning or any damage such as fractures and burn marks. A more serious issue is over lubrication which can produce a buildup of hard deposits that cause abrasion and polishing, damaging not only the cylinder liner, but also the piston rings. With the piston lowered, it's then possible to look up and make a visual examination of the liner, checking for obvious signs of cold corrosion, abrasion, or inappropriate lubrication. For a more thorough inspection, it is advisable to combine this with planned major maintenance when cylinder heads are removed and pistons lifted. This enables a closely detailed examination by the inspector with repairs and replacements carried out accordingly. Over time, combustion causes carbon to build up in the grooves behind the piston rings, blocking the rings from seating correctly and forcing them hard against the cylinder walls. When pistons are lifted for servicing, this carbon has to be removed. In extreme cases, the wear can cause the cylinder wall to distort, allowing dangerous sideways movement of the piston, as well as removing the sealing ability of the piston rings. An engine inspection will identify this problem at an early stage. With the piston lifted, a very thorough examination of the cylinder liner will then be carried out to assess its operational life expectancy or the need for a complete replacement. A close inspection of the liner will establish the degree of any damage and provide guidance on the optimum cylinder oil feed rate that will be required to combat the condition. Engine inspections are planned well in advance, often as part of scheduled maintenance. Logs and records will provide an operational history highlighting any mechanical issues. This will ensure that spare parts are available as required. No operator can afford unnecessary downtime due to avoidable breakdowns or stoppages. Regular inspections are a vital part of good management, ensuring the safe, reliable running of an efficient and profitable vessel. In this fifth program of the series, we have looked at that vital element of marine engine management, the engine inspection, a health check that should give a clean bill of health or a diagnosis of problems before they become a crisis. In program six of the series, Managing Operating Costs, we'll look at how all the engine data gathered by ExxonMobil over the years is enabling ship operators to achieve the highest performance from their vessels. For further information and guidance on the subjects covered, visit the website at exxonmobil.com forward slash marine.